Same in the room, like still vibrating from the heart. Like, yeah, 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 I was like, is this the final fill up? See you next year, baby. Good morning, guys. Wow, if you guys watched last week's vlog, we just rode a thousand miles, Deadwood, South Dakota to Las Vegas, Nevada. Just woke up in Las Vegas. We're all pretty exhausted right now. We still have to make it home, ride from basically Las Vegas to Los Angeles. I'm gonna head downstairs. We're all supposed to meet up at the uh, breakfast spot and uh, get this day going. Oh, thousand mile crushers, baby. I put our name in, but we're in Vegas and it's a 45 minute wait at the breakfast spot at the hotel. So I think we should go to the little uh, coffee shop, maybe grab a coffee. Yep. Tell them we'll go to the coffee shop, put my name in, unless they have another idea or want to get off the strip and get breakfast. All right. Or just a little snack and we hit the road. Okay. My boys, you guys looking for me? Yeah. Mile crushers. Well, you know what? We had a great sleep and I'm still uh, a little foggy because we did, Evan and I, and uh, Harry had a- You, you guys know, stay down a little, little bit. Nice. <laughs> but right not, on, right on. Not I, I, uh, the bed was amazing. The, sh the, the blinds were amazing. I got a decent sleep considering I was still vibrating by the time I got in bed on the right, right. motorcycle. I was just saying, what a way to end the thousand mile run, right? Right. Like just in a nice bed and nice soap and showers and just. <laughs> Come over here, Juan and I were in this coffee shop. They have a little breakfast. The breakfast line is pretty long. I don't know if you guys want to. Evan do that. and them are at the terrace and they're finished eating. We're just drinking coffee on okay, the table. Okay. Yeah, I'll grab one. Good morning. Five full hours of sleep. We're feeling good. And uh, it's time for breakfast. More great riding today. Did he just say five hours? Yeah. There's no way he got five we hours. We woke up at 3.30. I woke up at 8. Four and a half. <laughs> no. Hey, you woke up at 7.30. Four hours. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. That was pretty dang good sleep, though. Like, the room was air conditioned nicely. Yeah. The TV. It was quiet. Maybe a, a 70 inch on, TV don't... right above my rollaway. There was no remote. So it, it was, was in nice. the iPad. I got you the had stare at the it. iPad. You guys left the Shit. TV on all night. I put a pillow over my head. Night. The iPad controlled the air, the TV, I the blinds, about it, but everything. I was like, probably nah. Yeah, he was like, dude, it's probably the iPad. Both of us, oh, maybe we won't check. Literally, <laughs> I. That's how delusional we were though last night. Like I came in the room like still vibrating from the heart. Like, yeah, yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah. Is this? so that's what woke me up. Like I felt like it was playing the whole time in my sleep. The TV because it was the same commercial. <laughs> we need to eat. I want some eggs. I want <laughs> They do a thousand miles, they get in a great room, and look what homie does. Chicken and waffles. Spicy chicken, chicken and waffles. Hey. hey, that looks killer. A, that's a gut buster. That looks bomb. I might run that back. Dude, that How is a gut buster. How was it? Was it pretty good? It was pretty good. I'm stoked. I don't know how I'll feel in like an hour on the bike ripping through the desert. That's yeah. it, Evan. Yeah, that's it, dude. Another great Sturgis in the books, brother. Yeah, that was a great job, man. Yeah. yeah, thank you guys for running hard with us. Yeah, man, thank you. You honestly helped motivate me a lot because you kept going, let's just wake up early. Yeah, like at the, at the house, you're like, well, let's just wake up early. Yeah. Let's go. And then you were like, we made it far. <laughs> me and Cameron made it far. Yeah. Like, let's just keep going. So I was like, I got to show these fueling guys that we can do it. Well, <laughs> well, you kept laying the nugget last night, too. You're like, oh, well, let's just do one more tank. And then it's like, oh. And now you're like tricking the brain. So it's like, oh, well, we made it this far. Well, let's just go one more. And yeah. the best thing, eventually they just had to realize we're going to Vegas, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no Brother. We're it was good hanging it, so. out with you. Yeah, you too. Yeah. Amen. All right, you guys are splitting off. Yeah, we're gonna go up to Mojave, up Mojave and throw this BBT on the dyno and see what it does. There you All go. Nice. Have a good trip, guys. Yeah, thousand miles yeah. in a day. You guys done that before? No, it's first time. Uh, once before. <laughs> ah, the, the youngest one. How old are you? Uh, 27. Yeah, the youngest one's already done it. You too. See you guys. I'm the youngest one, baby. Oh yeah. How, how old are you? 26. Your beard, your beard, and your uh, personality, yeah, 26, your persona yeah, come off a little baby. stronger. Yeah. Yeah. I'll give you a different. I used to ride some more bikes too, and then all the trips we would do were like just a little canyon run, an hour or two, and like that was it. And then getting in, transitioning to the Harley world, it's like two or three days, four days, weeks. It's like you realize how much more you could go. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Get out of here, breakfast is good, and rooms for a couple minutes. How long till we're back down? No later than 11.30. 11.30. All right, meet down. 11.30, back on the road. Yeah. Here, one. What's that, bro? This pass bag, straight up, 
always blows my mind every day we use it. Like not only is it easy to strap onto your bike, you but the backpack it. straps that are sewn into it and just clip on at the bottom. That's clutch. And yeah. the fact that now I'm hands-free, my helmet's clipped to it. Do you Dude, hats normal? clipped to it, all my clothes, only thing I'm carrying is my laptop. Yeah, normally we're like, yeah, normally we're like, like helmet, bag, and then your hands get tired because the bikes are pretty far away. Yeah. So like it's been clutch. Like Turn around, let me, let me see. Look at how dial that is. Helmet strapped to it, hands-free backpack straps sewn in. Yeah. Then they go down and clip on, so they're always with you. Yeah, normally we're like, Josh. You should have seen me on my way back from Milwaukee for the 120th. Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. I was carrying three things around. I had to run across the airport to get food, and I'm running back, dropping, dropping shit, dropping my helmet. It's good to know. So now you know. You have a prototype one, but you're yeah. still rocking it. What up? Yeah, baby. There's the beast. Oh, it's nice and warm out, boys. Oh, it's Feel that heat? nice and warm. It's toasty. Ooh. There they are. I like to. Uh, Go somewhere in the hotel, you can park right in front of it, get your shit in the room and do that. This kind of stuff where you gotta walk 18 miles, seven elevators. <laughs> so much truth to that. All right, let's get loaded up and get out of here. All right, my bike's on empty. I think a couple of theirs are as well. So we're gonna head over to a gas station, fill up. Notice yesterday's miles. I'm gonna zero that trip out right now. Boom, let's go hit it for the day. Let's get out of here. It's the 10th day on the road for 2023 Sturgis. We are on the last leg in Las Vegas. Yesterday, we rode a thousand miles. We're headed home, baby. It's time to roll. We're hopping on the freeway and we're right into some bumper to bumper traffic and Nevada does not let you lane split. the last gas stop yeah 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 and what, what's the temp it was already like a hundred and something 103 okay. and we were just in the 40s yesterday with hail yeah now i'm like can we get a little of that surges rain out here we're going through the desert grab you a water i was just about to get some and i see you okay. carrying a whole pile out yeah thank you yes. oh thank boy you, here you go dad awesome thank you yes sir you know, hey bro i want to make sure you drink this by you know how you know it's hot? Huh. We've only been on the bikes for five minutes and all the helmets are off because everyone's head sweat. That's a big reason why we wear modulars, to be yeah. honest.
smells really good. Yeah, baby. This is where we started. We still got a little bit more miles to go, but let me see how many miles so far. We've done 3,174 miles. And a thousand of, that, of those miles were just yesterday. Yeah, boy. This is where the trip started. That's right, man. Full circle, baby, love it. Digging the weather, it's warm out, but it's like there's no sun, so it's kind of cool. And it, I definitely think it was the right call to do the thousand and then just have a nice 400 mile ride on 300 mile ride. Home. Easy peasy. I'll let you do the honors. Final the final fill up. up. All right, the boys are hungry, so there actually might be a little, a last supper. Oh, hey, brother. Thanks, bro. You got me dialed. We haven't had these since nice we left boy. here. Yeah. <laughs> these are like our go tos at the office when it's hot. Oh my God. Fire. Straight fire. So good. Here it is. One last final taco review <laughs> for 2023 Sturgis Run. The world famous Del Taco. Maybe the best tacos of the whole trip. So, hey, fun fact, if I'm almost like positive, the original Del it's Taco not is not, not this one, but it's like, around here it's in barstow oh I mean, really yeah, yeah where yes. they started how's the fish tank when you walk in and this dude these are from when we were kids they're empty want to get a new tattoo i'll do uh one taco del carbon i'll do uh carne asada guacamole or without guacamole no guacamole and then can i get one just del taco and then one grilled chicken taco soft three crispy chicken tacos it's already ready. The meal of champions. <laughs> really sad. Taco down, bro. That's what I know I got one Dell. How do you know what they are? Well, those are all Dell the Dells. Did I get two? This is like yeah, a case of yeah. We're all scarfing. One's not even here yet. Who knows? Crispy, carbon, chicken soft. Juan got some weird, like, fish stick looking thing. Uh, where's my third one, bro, Audrey? Joe Garcia. That is it, dude. We just spent 10 days on the road, over 3,300 miles, nine days of rain. Epic journey, a trip to remember. We did yeah. a lot of fun stuff. I feel like this one's gonna be one for the books. I mean, like you said, we did that Iron Butt Challenge for ourselves. I think this is one of those trips that we're always just gonna be talking about. Like, dude, do you remember that time where yep. we just did 1,000 miles out of nowhere? We just kept going. I think, like you said, there was a lot of things that made it memorable, the freaking weather. You're at, man. I think it was a solid team and we all freaking get along well. And it was rad and thanks everyone for tuning in and supporting us and- uh, Yeah, seriously, yeah. thank you everyone for following along. We're gonna get back to the shop, get all settled into our new location, and we'll let you guys know when it's open and you can come by and say what up. But with that being said, we will see you guys on the next one. See you later. Later, dude. Later, guy. Awesome trip. Yeah, thank you for having me. Any last words? See you next year, baby. I'm gonna words? concur with that next year. See you down the road. Can you well, say see you later? Good times.